You've heard their names all election season long, Dennis Bova and Marianne Buttonshawn. And while they're both newcomers to the political arena, tonight they made their platforms loud and clear. The first and only scheduled debate in the race for New York's 119th assembly seat happening tonight in Utica. That seat becoming clear as Assemblyman Anthony Brindisi takes aim at a congressional seat against incumbent Congresswoman Claudia Tenney. The pair tonight, though, hitting on a range of topics, especially how they think minorities can gain workforce experience in the current job market. Employers have to have that desire to ensure that there is a healthy balance, and that balance needs to be uh, within uh, the workforce, within, as you stated, within the schools, uh, within the faculty that we have, the staff. It is, it is always a challenge for us, but it is one that is very important. We need to take these folks from every background and treat them all as equal and see what special needs they need so they can flourish. I would propose having, talking to the teachers first of all, I think that's the most important part, seeing the people on the front line and the grade school saying, okay, you see these kids developing, what do you need so they can have the tools they need to go to college and become successful if they choose to go to college. We'll have full profiles on both of these candidates come Friday.